We don't like to call ourselves experts, but that was pretty easy. I mean, look, you just plug it right in. That'll work, right? <laughs> Snorkel. So one thing you want to make sure of when you're doing an install like this is that you have all like the proper tools and stuff already. So for this, you're supposed to drill a three inch hole in the uh, quarter panel right here. Alex was looking at like videos and stuff and everyone says to use a three and a quarter so that way you have more like leeway. And this isn't what holds the whole thing up anyway so it's okay if there's extra, a little bit of extra room. So yeah, I would, it's always good to do like research and stuff. And so if you're doing a snorkel, just three and a quarter, and it'll fit much, much better. So another huge pro tip when you're doing stuff like this, when you're drilling into metal, always start with a smaller bit, and always try and punch the hole to keep your drill bit like on the line, on the spot that you want, because otherwise it'll be, it'll walk itself all over and then you'll have to re-drill it wrong, and it's just a pain in the ass. So yeah, always start smaller, and then go bigger. Okay, so now that we got these holes drilled, we have to put the bracket in up here that keeps it from like flapping around and getting in the way of the door. So what we're gonna do is uh, just lightly attach the bracket to the snorkel and the snorkel to the car, and then we'll try and mark on the car here uh, where we have to drill. And that way we know it's exactly where we want it to be. So after we have all the holes drilled and everything, we took some nail polish. The worse the color, the better. And it seals up the bare metal that we just exposed, just to keep it from rusting and stuff. So when you're ready to put the bracket on that goes up here, definitely be careful because it's popper fits and not bolts because you can't get in there from the inside. So they're a little less forgiving. So make sure you mark your holes. You probably, oh you can barely see them. Make sure you mark those holes good. So now we're drilling the last hole for the hose on the bottom. Kind of a pain in the ass to get in there, but it works. boxes back in and all we have to do is connect this hose over up there that thing yeah last piece of the puzzle attaching the hose to the snorkel up there comes down it looks good to be honest we didn't really know much about what we were doing. I mean, we know how to tighten some bolts and stuff, but uh, it's quite easy to figure out. So if you're looking for something to do, it's a great mod to do. All right, guys, thank you for watching, and get outside and do some mods. <laughs>